I'm planning to simplify problem three. And the polynomial that we have is negative 4m squared minus 6m. And you notice that we have the minus here. That minus is going to give us the opposite value for this polynomial. So for example, we have 6m, that's going to be negative 6m, and we have 4m squared, so that's going to be negative 4m squared. The next step is to combine like terms. A common mistake that students think is that it's all these are going to be zero, but in fact we know that negative 4 plus negative 4 gives us negative 8m squared, and we know that negative 6m minus 6m gives us negative 12m. We have negative 8m squared minus 12m. What we're doing now is we're multiplying this binomial, which is x plus 1, times the trinomial, which is 2x squared minus 3x plus 1. So what we're going to do is we're going to do the distributive property. We have x times 2x, which gives us 2x to the third power. We have x times negative 3x, which gives us negative 3x squared. And then we have x times 1, which gives us x. x times 1 gives us x. Now we're not done. Now in the binomial we had the x and we accounted for the x. Now we have to account for the 1. So 1 times 2x squared, I'm going to put it underneath negative 3x squared. And then 1 times negative 3, I'm going to write negative 3x, so it's negative 3x. And then we have 1 times 1, which gives us plus 1. And then I'm going to combine, I'm combining like terms. Since I don't have an x cubed here, I'm just going to drop this and I'm going to have 2x cubed. We know that negative 3x squared plus 2x squared gives us negative x squared. And we know that x minus 3x gives us negative 2x. And then since we didn't have anything up here, this constant, we're going to go ahead and write plus 1. So when we multiply the binomial times the trinomial, we get the following as a product of the two.